Well, it's hard to believe, but hockey season is back. The Minnesota Wild open up on the road against the Colorado Avalanche. But this morning, we are getting geared up, waking up with the Wild. Nordy is waking up as well, but Allie Lucia has one of our friends from the Wild this morning. Hey, Allie. Hey, Jason, good morning. I can't believe hockey season is already here. So we are on the second floor of U.S. Bank Plaza right in the Skyway level and all morning long until 8 o'clock. The Wild are going to be passing out a ton of goodies, including some caribou coffee and a bunch of different drinks. And I'm joined by the executive director of the Minnesota Wild Foundation, Rachel Schultz. And Rachel, you guys have a lot of exciting things going on this season. Obviously, opener on the road tonight, but this month specifically, you guys are accepting uh, grant applications for your grant program. Who are you looking for when, when it comes to those grants? Yeah, so we're really excited. It's the Wild Idea Grant Program, and it's sort of an entrepreneurial idea. So we're hoping to give up to $200,000 in grants from ten dollars to $50,000. And we're looking for groups that have projects or research that support families with a child with serious illnesses um, or the growth of the game, so access to hockey. We here in Minnesota, of course, are all about our purple pride, and you've got some gear on, and so do I as well, a lavender scarf. And it's all to support Hockey Fights Cancer Month, which goes on the entire month of October. But how are you guys celebrating specifically? So we have lots of great programming for Hockey Fights Cancer. You're wearing some of it. I'm wearing some of it. The Hockey Lodge has got this lavender merchandise, and a portion of the proceeds are going to go to Hockey Fights Cancer. You can also do a donation at cash registers if you want to just give. Um, our Levy concession stands are allowing fans to round up their purchase or make a donation um, at all wild games throughout October and then we've got our big hockey fights cancer night on the 27th you'll see lavender everywhere dasher boards um, hockey fights cancer jerseys which we will auction off um, yeah just lots of purple hockey fights cancer so game one of the season tonight you guys are home on Saturday but uh, tell us a little bit about the setup here on the second floor. Sure, so we've got coffee. Caribou is gonna give away, uh, for every cup of coffee we give away this morning, they're gonna donate to PD or cancer patients um, and nurses at local cancer care centers. Newspapers, magnet schedules, some treats, yeah. The whole wild uh, fan gamut here. Rachel, thank you so much for joining us thank this you morning. Thank me, thanks Allie. So we wanna let you know if you are interested in watching the game outside, you can head over to CHS Field. That is tonight, and I'm pretty sure Matt Brickman said there won't be any rain, so the doors open at 645, and that event is free and open to the public just down the street from the XL Energy Center. So get out and support the Minnesota Wild as they take on the Colorado Avalanche tonight. All right, Allie, thanks so much. I love how festive you are in your green jacket there. That's right. She's all geared up for the Wild now. Ready for the puck drop? NHL season is underway. The Minnesota Wild open up on the road against the Colorado Avalanche. This morning we are waking up with the Wild and Nordy. So is Allie Lucia. Hey, Allie. Good morning, Kim. We are on the second floor of U.S. Bank Plaza right outside Caribou. Nordy is here. The Wild are here. They are ready to go for the season. Nordy, what do you have in your hand? They're giving away magnet schedules as well as some Caribou coffee this morning. So if you're in the area and maybe want to take a short, brisk walk and get a magnet schedule or maybe some coffee, feel free to stop on by. Nordy, we're good. You can, you can go and wave to some fans. Thank Thanks, you for your help today. I'm joined by John Maher, the Vice President of Communications of the Minnesota Wild. And John, uh, very exciting time game one you guys are on the road but how are you celebrating today with the Absolutely. season uh, till eight o'clock here as you mentioned folks can come and get a free cup of caribou coffee uh nordy's here and we have uh some free newspapers for folks this morning so yeah come out and get ready for the opening of the season tonight uh then we'll be back over in st paul tonight at chs field uh for a viewing party so fans will be able to go out onto the field um and enjoy the game on the giant screen out in left field so we just want to celebrate the opening of the season. It's been, you know, a long off season since those playoff runs, and we're ready to get going again. Now you guys uh, come back and play on Saturday here at home in St. Paul at the XL Energy Center, and I know the Wild are all about the pregame party. So how can people partake in the party, even if they maybe don't even have a ticket to the game? Yep, there's a pregame event out in front of XL Energy Center between Gate One and Two, uh, from four to six p.m. So come out early for that. And then if you do have a ticket to the game, we encourage you to get into your seats early. Uh, great pregame show on the ice, introducing our 2015-16 Minnesota Wild. Uh, there are some new security measures at the gates that folks should be aware of and take a little extra time to uh, go through those probably for the first game for opening night. Um, the, uh, as you saw, the giveaway is going to be the magnet schedule on Saturday night. So just an exciting weekend with the road opener tonight and then home on Saturday. 
Does it feel like a short off season for those of you in the front office, especially considering just the, the way the playoffs went and now we're already back in the swing of things? It felt short, but you know, we want to make it shorter because that means we've played longer into May and June. So next year, let's make it even shorter. Well, John, thank you so much for joining us this morning. As John mentioned, for those of you that do want to cheer on the Minnesota Wild tonight against the Colorado Avalanche, feel free to just uh, try that short walk from the XL Energy Center over to CHS Field. The doors open at 645. The event is free, so you can head on out and cheer on the Wild. Puck drop is at 8 o'clock tonight because they are playing on Mountain Time. So cheer on the Wild and game one tonight, game two on Saturday. All right, Allie, thank you so much. Uh, I'm sorry, Ellie, I don't think we're going to be leaving you any of these donuts that the Wild dropped off for us. So lovely of them and very festive. These are from Mojo Monkey. You can see the Roman numeral 15 on there. It's the Wild's 15th season that starts tonight. So it's got that lovely wild green. And which a chocolate-covered strawberry. In any other circumstance, that is not a color you want on a donut. No. Or any food. Yeah. yeah. But it kind of works for the okay. wild, it right? It does. And I like the fruit inside. on top. We're keeping it balanced and healthy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and there's strawberry filling yeah. and cream. Mm -hmm. There's, you so know, you got that's dairy. dairy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Wow. balanced huh. breakfast that right was, here. That was impressive, impressive work there. Yeah, just ignore the frosting, the chocolate, <laughs> and the glaze. Otherwise, it's great.